The government of Trinidad and Tobago has amplified its efforts in the fight against HIV and AIDS with the launch of the Treat All campaign. Speaking at the Medical Research Center on Thursday, Health Minister Terence de Alsing said the Dr. Keith Rowley-led administration has made great strides in its fight against the spread of the deadly virus. However, he said that 2010 to 2015 were barren years as far as the HIV AIDS program is concerned. The last administration, for reasons best known to them, refused to cooperate with the CDC and with the American government to access PEPFAR funding. This country let millions of dollars of grant funding, not loan funding, grant funding, free money, go to waste. It is only when we came into office and I understood the gravity of the HIV AIDS problem facing us, and I understood that you needed resources, that we were able to save PEPFAR within about one year. The Health Ministry applied for and received funding from the United States President's Emergency Plan for AIDS Relief, better known as PEPFAR. Faced with the question of what to do with the grant, Minister Dale Singh took a note to Cabinet proposing that it be used for the Medical Research Foundation of Trinidad and Tobago. Cabinet eagerly adopted the position that MRFTT should be the conduit between CDC, PEPFAR, and the people of Trinidad and Tobago to spend these funds. And this $1.5 million um, TT has really boosted the response to HIV AIDS. He expressed his wish that Trinidad and Tobago be the first country within the Western Hemisphere to achieve its goal of 90 by 90 by 90 by the year 2020. What this means is that by 2020, 90% of the population should know their status, 90% of those diagnosed should be on antiretroviral drugs, and 90% of those receiving treatment should have their viral load suppressed to a point where transmission of the disease is impossible. Meanwhile, Charge de Fay at the U.S. Embassy, John McIntyre, reaffirmed their commitment to aid the health ministry in its quest to halt the spread of HIV and AIDS. He said the fight against HIV and AIDS is an integral part of their mission here and with governments around the world. Dion Batiste, C News.